Welcome back to another episode of Lucid Daily, and today we have quite a bit of things that we need to go over, so let's go ahead and get started. First off, Lucid was down 3.28%. They were up 0.15% in the after hours. Lucid is now trading for, trading for $20.32 a share. Next, Tesla was up about 2% today, and it's up 0.87% in the after hours. Rivian was down 5.8% today. Um, their CEO did make some comments regarding the battery supply, which I don't know if that affected their stock price today, but I can take a little bit of a dive into that a little bit later. So Bears Workshop did have another flyover today. And as you can tell, there are a lot of cars piling up. And as you can tell, there's a lot of car holders, out, car haulers out here. There's some cars out here. They appear to be all Grand Tourings. I don't see any gold out here, which is good, which hopefully, fingers crossed, means the production of the Dream Edition is finally over. Now we got to get that the end of production. We got to get those Dream Deliveries, Dream Editions delivered. So overall, I'm actually really excited with the amount of cars we're seeing. This is great progress, and I'm actually really excited with the production um, and everything that's looking like that Lucid's on track and hitting some good numbers. So Time will tell. I I am planning on their earnings being around May 28th. I do know Tesla's earnings on Wednesday. So if you're an investor, if you're at all interested in the EV space, keep an eye out for that one. Um, I will be doing a, an earnings preview, but we do have a little bit of ways for that. Um, so yeah, May 28th is what I would game plan for. Lucid is really pushing this grand touring, which I really like. They're taking it. I mean, tweeting things is virtually free. Obviously, you're paying somebody's salary to do that, but they are able to they are pushing this car out a ton. Hopefully, they're trying to get as many reservations as they can. I mean, obviously, they're trying to do that, but hopefully, we can see the goals are on 7,000 reservations a quarter for right now. Hopefully, this quarter, we can see above 7,000. 7,000 or above reservations, I'm pumped for. So just keep an eye out for that, and I will, I will talk about this in my valuation spreadsheet once we get there. So this was an interesting tweet. Um, Lucid uh, 2028 Lucid tweeted out, "Wow, thanks for posting Vladimir Bello Bello Cohen." Uh, many Lucid airs. I but when I searched for this um, person on Twitter, I was not able to see their page was like private. Um, but they did tweet out this picture where you can see a ton of cars where they're just they're just lined up, and you can see gold here. So these are Dream Edition, Dream Edition. And there's literally probably close to 40, 50 cars out here from the best I can tell. Um, and you do see a Dream Edition right here. So I don't know if Lucid is shipping their cars here right here. I try to find some context from this picture. Picture. I um, mean, this these are some Dream Edition tires right here. Let me move my picture really quick for you guys. Um, those are some Dream Edition wheels right there. I mean, sorry, not tires, wheels. So I don't want to say I'm concerned, but I'm, I'm really want to know the context of this picture and exactly what these pictures are. If anybody knows, go ahead and leave it down in the comments because more than anything, I'm just super curious why they have lots of cars just sitting here. I don't know if they're moving them to make space in the parking lot. It looks like they have lots of space. I don't know if they're gonna do one big delivery event. I have no idea. Let me know what you guys think, why there are so many cars sitting here in this parking lot. I'd love to hear you guys' thoughts on it. Maybe you guys can help me out. But again, I'm excited with the production numbers we're seeing. Hopefully we can continue to ramp that up. And hopefully we can get more than 7,000 reservations this quarter. I appreciate your support. If you guys got any sort of value from this content, um, consider subscribing for daily content on Lucid. And like always, we'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.